Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you are doing well. I pray for you all. God give you a long life and you live always happily there. Please like and share this video and also subscribe my YouTube channel. I have a request to you all. Watch this video till end for supporting me. So let's start with information. These are some updates on the NAR. Before starting the video, I have to tell you something. Go to google.com and search janaropinions.com and open this site. Here you can see the latest news, dinar opinions, and dinar guru updates on a single page. So visit this site for more information. We know elections are coming up and we know what happened last election. I'm not trying to jinx it but we're definitely hoping that everything goes a lot smoother than it did last election. In July Alok the central bank governor said the project to delete the zeros off the currency exchange rate still exists. I think it's fascinating and awesome. Article, The President of the Republic, There is no dollar crisis in Iraq of course not. There's a new national currency and a new exchange rate coming. And everyone knows it. Iraq has, told us there will be no budget deficit in 2024. Next year's budget starts Jan 1st. Without a revalued currency their deficit should be over $100 billion. So the only way they cannot have a budget deficit is with a change of value in their currency, that is news worth reporting. And Iraq says they will be totally de-dollarized by Jan 1st. They are telling us what they are doing. Article, Government Source starting to implement the banking arrangements agreement with Turkey. Quote, the central bank has reinforced tens of millions of euros as. There is a meeting going on in Dubai, what they're doing is finalizing the exchange rate. They got the currency in position and what they need to do is, get the exchange rate in position too. You are now standing on the grounds of the RD and you're soon to walk into the float. These are the steps. This is the journey you've taken whether you recognize it and understand it or not. The monetary reform is moving forward beautifully. For Iraq it's not a question if more dollars are coming into Iraq, it's do the average citizens have access to them. That's what they're trying to fight, they want to take the dollar out so the supply times velocity of the dinar goes up. Pay stations around the country where you can cash in your dinar as she's full of crap. Pay stations? I guess that's the same as redemption centers, right? Let me put it this way, how does everybody else deal with other international currencies? Why would Iraq be special for some reason? It's not like Iraq's the only currency to be devalued and possibly revalued. All international currencies are done the same way. There's no 800 numbers. There's no redemption centers. There's no pay stations or however way you want to cleverly call these things. It's all bull crap. IQD is bought and sold the same way as all the other currencies. You can go to any currency exchange location and swap out your currencies or buy currencies there. Go to any international airport and they will have a currency exchange center there. No there's no special stations planted all around the world specifically for the IQD.